Hey, how you doing? I'm Trina Sanders, and you're tuned in once again to the famous Living Rim Network. Divine powers are always working for us because we do right. That's right. You've tuned into the correct video. You are probably that successful person who I'm going to get this message to because you are about to make this. All right. Do you see this closely? What does that number read? One million dollars. This is not a six figure number. This is a seven figure earner. OK, this is you. If you have already done these three sacrifices that I'm about to reveal to you in this video, chances are you're about to make your first M. That's what they call it. A M. OK, your first million dollars. Now, of course, this is not real. OK, but this will manifest into your reality. If all of these three things that I'm about to reveal to you in this video, you have done. Now, when we talk about sacrifices, we're not talking about some biblical stuff like putting lambs and ox on the altar or something and hoping that the ashes go up and the gods bless you with some type of success. No, we're talking about real life stuff. OK, on your journey to success, right when you're about to become successful, if you are there right now, you will have to make three real life sacrifices. Now, this is the last part of the process, okay, before you actually make it big, before you become successful. And if you've already done these three things and you're wondering when your success is going to come, I'm about to let you know in this video right now. All right. So stay tuned through this video. Now, if you're already subscribed to me, you know the drill here on the Famous Living Room Network. If one of these sacrifices resonate with you, at least just one of them resonate with you. OK, then you will make that million dollars. All right. So what you will need to do is smash the like button only on the sacrifice that you have already done. OK, if you get all three sacrifices Comment at the very end of the video and let us all know that you got all three sacrifices and you are about to be successful. We want to know who the successful people are. OK, don't forget about the little people here. All right. So here's the first thing you need to know about success. Chances are, if you're still watching this video right now, you are already successful. That's right. The problem is you just can't see it. You need people outside of you, such as me to be able to tell you, okay? I'm like a messenger. I'm just a mailman for the universe. I just tell you and remind you that if you are on the journey to success, okay, then you are already successful. Yes, you are already successful. The problem with most people who are successful is the grind has consumed them. The hustle has consumed you to the point that you don't even realize that you are already successful. OK, it's kind of like you become blind in the midst of the grind. You become blind, like with a blindfold on and you can't even see how great you really is. But other people around you outside of you. OK, they see your success. And that's why people are acting all funny and they're treating you like less than average and all this and that. Listen, I'm about to tell you three sacrifices in this video that you must do in order for you to become successful. All right. Now, here's the first thing that you must do and the sacrifice that you must make. OK, you got to be willing to give up your old life for a totally new lifestyle. All right. You got to want a totally new lifestyle before you can become successful. That's a sacrifice. OK, once upon a time you used to live like this. OK, you know who you used to be like four or five years ago before you got on your journey to success. You remember that life. Some of you already have relocated and went to different places. OK, you remember who you was. Now it's time to cash it all in and just say to yourself, you know what? I want a totally new experience, man. Now, it might be easy for you to say right now that you want to live a totally new life. But when it all hits the fan and you really do actually catapult into this new life of success, you might miss your old life. OK, but you got to be 100 percent certain. 100% for sure that you want to live a totally new life, okay? Now, living this totally new life, what you got to do is you got to be able to say goodbye to all your old friends, okay? People who wasn't on your journey to success. People who didn't give you credit back when you was grinding and, you know, crafting uh, and doing the things that you were doing now in order to become successful. You got to be willing to say, you know what? I don't even want to go to the old places I used to hang out anymore. You know, it might be some family members in your life that you don't even hang out anymore. This is what it's all about 
when you become successful. This is a sacrifice you have to make. It's kind of like giving up what you used to love for a totally new love, a totally new partner, so to speak. OK, so that's the first sacrifice that you must make. You got to be willing to give up your old life to live a totally new life. And if that's you, and if you've already done that, then you have made a sacrifice. It's kind of like that song that little Duval has. I'm living my best life. I ain't going back. <laughs> Y'all remember that song? He said he's living his best life and he ain't going back. What he's referring to is he not going back to his old ways. He not going back to his old life. He not going back to places he once used to hang out at. He thought was cool at that time. He's living a totally new life. He's living his best life, okay? So if you've made the sacrifice to be able to say, you know what? I don't even want to live my old life anymore. I want to live a totally new lifestyle. Then you have made a sacrifice and that is what you need right before you can become successful, all right? Now, the second sacrifice that you must make before you can become successful is this. You got to be willing to give up stability and comfort, all right? No more can you play it safe. I mean, if you've been on this journey the proper way, okay, you have already have not been playing it safe. Every day should be a risk to you, okay? When it comes to success, success is all about taking risk, okay? Most people think that success is about being stable, having a comfortable job, making sure everything's always constantly balanced, you know, just taking the safe way, the safe way out. Failing to realize that's just living average, okay? If you want to be successful, you have to make the sacrifice of giving up your own stability, okay? Giving up comfortability, okay? You got to get into a habit of being able to deal with other people who begin to talk about, oh, you know, my life is good and I have a house and I got a nice family and everything is going well and the dogs are barking outside and the birds are chirping. That's average lifestyle. OK, when you want to become successful, you know that there is no stability. OK, you're always constantly living on the edge. All right. Successful people are always on the edge at all times. All right. Even though they might be rich. OK, they they circulate their money. They spend their money all to invest in themselves. OK, comfortable, comfortable, average people who just live in to just be regular. OK, they are scared to spend their money. They are scared to invest their money into themselves. OK, so if you're in a financial uh position right now to where you don't have the type of money that you think that you should have because you are already successful. That's absolutely normal. As long as you have been making investments to yourself, within yourself, you know, building up your business, you know, giving back to your craft, making you better, then you are becoming successful. You've made a sacrifice. If your life right now it's like it's like a tornado had just came through and just turned everything upside down. You don't know what to expect, but you know for a fact that you are successful. Then that is a sacrifice that you have made. You've given up your old life for a new one and you've given up the mediocre lifestyle that most people live to where they're very, very stable. OK, so if that sacrifice resonated with you, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Be completely honest. I want to know who the honest people are. Smash that thumbs up button if that sacrifice resonated with you and if you already done it before. All right. Now, the third sacrifice, last but not least, the third sacrifice that you must make before you can actually become successful is you have to make the sacrifice to stop acting poor. All right. You can no longer act poor anymore. Now that you know you are already successful and I'm confirming it to you in this video because this video is a sign, all right? You're about to make $1 million, all right? If you did all of these three sacrifices and no longer can you act poor, all right? Many people want to be successful, but they don't want to act successful. You know, they want to be like everybody else wants them to be. When you are successful, you can no longer even care to think what other people think that you should act like. OK, if you are successful, then you have to dress the part. OK, you have to dress the part. I mean, if you don't even if you don't have the type of clothes or the fabric or the jewelry or whatever you want to wear, you have to make something out of nothing. You have to take what you have and treat it as though it's so valuable that it makes you appear successful. OK, remember. Success is all about your self-image. However you see yourself, if you see yourself successful, then other people are going to see yourself successful, okay? So 
With knowing that, you have to align yourself up with your very own status of success. There are many people who are indeed successful people, but they are afraid to align their self-confidence up to the same status of the work and the effort that they've been putting out. Okay. When you are putting out so much effort, when you are going hard for your success and you are grinding your butt off, it is okay to treat yourself. It is okay to act a little high and mighty. Okay. It is okay to say, you know what? I love myself. All right. So you got to stay away from people who have a lack mindset. You got to be able to notice that in order for you to act 100% successful. Because remember, when you act like you are successful, it's only going to attract more successful people to you, whether they know you're successful or not, which you already are. But when you have the image of success, it's going to be reflected in the exterior, the external universe outside of you. Okay. And you're going to only attract successful people, successful circumstances, and successful things back into your reality, okay? Now, once again, like I said, be careful of who you mingle with. Be careful of who you make your friends. You can no longer hang around people of a limited mindset. You can no longer hang around people who don't want to be successful or who don't even care to even think about the word success, okay? You're a totally different person, and the sacrifice that you must make is you have to give up your mindset that you are poor. You are no longer poor anymore. You can no longer think poor. You can no longer say things are expensive. You can no longer act like you're not worthy to have everything that you will have once you get that one million dollars. All right. Now, if all three of these sacrifices resonated with you, make sure that you comment below and leave a comment and be like, I am already successful at blah, blah, blah. Okay, whatever you're going to be successful at, I need you to go ahead and sign your autograph and write out what you do, whatever your craft or your trade is or your career path is, write out, I am already successful at dot, 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 dot in the comment section. You must write it out in order to receive this $1 million because this message was simply just a confirmation, okay? So you want to make sure that you let the messenger gods on Mount Olympus know that you actually received this confirmational message that you have made the sacrifices that it takes before you can become successful. Did this message resonate with you? Smash that thumbs up if this message resonated with you. Remember, I'm Trina Henderson. I am your life coach. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel by clicking my face icon up there. Subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notification so you can be notified every time I give confirmational videos like these two right here. Check out this video right here. These are the hidden things that will happen before you make it to success. Hidden things. Check this video out right here or check this one out. In the meantime, just know that you are already successful. Peace.